Hello everybody, and welcome to the Sinking City. It is currently 10.22 at night, but I really wanted to be able to record today. I don't know if this is a horror game, it definitely kind of feels like it. Uh, I don't know if I said this, but I turned off all my lights. <laughs> And I'm quite excited to play this. I was trying to find something to play for like my first game back. I thought I was going to escape that with my update video. Turns out I didn't. But I've been wanting to play this for a while. It sat in my collection for a while because I've always been very fascinated with these kind of like large eldritch entities and shit like this, which is what this is based off of. This is kind of based off of HP Lovecraft in the Victorian era. But enough talking about the game. Let's actually get into it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what the heck? is going on for the record I have no idea where this game is going to be going with stuff I just know that it has some things that I'm into oh my god I'm gonna just turn up my audio real quick Shh. no Okay, the Sharon ship, and there is a large, uh, terrifying entity on the wall. Just grab my camera, grab... That's, yeah, that's a gun right there. Whoa, I'm not doing... never have to use it, but something tells me I will. Probably. As you requested, I've researched outbursts of hysteria and visions in the city of Oakmount, Mass. It turns out that your assumptions were correct, such... Excuse me. Such cases are indeed more frequent here. Men and women from across the country are drawn to Oakmount, haunted by missions similar to yours. Visions similar to yours. Excuse me, I'm illiterate. A city drowning, the presence of something great yet unknown. As luck has it, I believe we have stumbled upon the source of your ailment and the person who might be able to help you with it. Perhaps prepare yourself. Then come to Oakmount as soon as you can. I will meet you here to help you on your way. Cordially, Johannes Vanderberg. Oh, wow. This is amazing. Casebook, press plus to activate. Whoa. Oh, okay. So are you like a detective? I thought you were a doctor. Oh, you're mister. I'm confused. Am I able to... Do I have a camera? I'm... Wait, I picked up a camera. What the... There's a skill tree? Oh, this... This is going to be good. Hello. Hi. Nope. That's Crouch. Come on. Nailed it. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's a... Photo of a trophy... Oh my god, that thing's real. No, 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 no. I'm... Oh, God. I'm gonna die. That's real. I am so boned. That's that. At last, Mr. Charles Reed. What a pleasure to finally meet you in the flesh. Nice to meet you. Uh... Johannes Vanderberg. I knew it was Johannes. I just I didn't... Ah. You the moment you arrived. Ah. 
Much obliged, Mr. Vanderberg. I guess I didn't expect you to mean so literally. Please call me your Hannes. But where are my manners? Welcome to the proud city of Oakmont. Alas, now is not its finest hour, though it is its most important. About my problem, what's to do with the city? Nice suit. What's to, I'm gonna do that. Dude, he looks... My god, he has not slept right in months. What's your name? Charles? Dude, you need some melatonin gummies. Just, actually, you already got nightmares. <laughs> Maybe melatonin gummies ain't the right idea. This rickety packet ship is the only one that sailed here. Why is that? Oakmont is no ordinary place. Its unique geographical position and the flood, a recent natural disaster, make it nigh impossible to reach. But you made it, Mr. Reed. I'm sure the tides of fate would have brought you here one way or another. Hmm. The flood. Oh, man. Oh, no, I'm not good in these games. I'm gonna no want to know every single little thing possible. Tell me about this flood. It began six months ago. Storms raged for several weeks. And the water has risen ever higher without receding. Now the city is cut off from the mainland. I must say I rather like it, despite the inconvenience. Atmosphere, you know? I do I do kind of understand that sometimes. Let's see. You said you know someone who can help me with my problem. The visions have been getting worse. Such vividness of dreams is not uncommon here in Oakmont. By chance, the man I spoke of, Robert Throgmorton. Is already at the port. He has <laughs> dedicated a lot of time and effort to investigate this issue. Alas, I fear he has a more pressing matter on his hands. I'll need a place to lay my head while I'm here. Any recommendations? Fear not. I've already feathered a nest for you. There's a room in your name at the Devil's Reef Hotel. Here's the key. Sounds charming. Don't judge a book by its cover, Mr. Reed. God, the dock sounds wonderful. Well, that's it for now, I think. Uh, thanks for helping me get my bearings. No, no. The pleasure was mine, Mr. Reed. Oh, before you go, how can I get in touch with you later? Don't worry about that. I'm the kind of man who finds you. Ah, right at the end, this man's getting mysterious. Oh, I love it. Oh! This is amazing, actually. Maybe this will actually help me with my D and D character right now. I have right now. Uh, I'm actually running a character at the moment by the name of Jack Devlin, Demon Detective, <laughs> which is very funny how the two somehow were able to line up. Holy crap! I think that's just a straight up octopus. Oh, this is so interesting! I can't believe I was actually able to match the two up so well. What the? What the hell? Wait, I thought it said I got everything. What are, are am I able to just scrounge for stuff to use for like? Is there crafting in this game? There's an upgrade tree and crafting in this game, possibly. Oh God, did I find another goodie? Oh yay, yay! Why can't I climb? I oh. God, another one that I'm gonna have no idea how to edit, but we are about to see how it's gonna goddamn go. Oh my god! The end is nigh. It will begin again. What is down comes up. The seed is sowed. Oh god, why am that is not good. That is not good. Oh I can sprint! <laughs> <laughs> Why? Not yet. Don't make me kill people yet, please. Oh god, I can already see myself just hunting around every little crevice and hole, just trying to find as many things as possible. Ooh, okay, that. Hello, pretty man in, in a white night suit. I'm gonna just walk this way. That's... Oh god, they took all his teeth. Granny Shark, no. <laughs> okay, let's just walk up to the nice man in the suit. 
with the Phantom of the Opera face. I don't care about your petty excuses. No one leaves the port until my son is found, and that is final. Uh, <clears throat> uh, excuse me. Are you Robert Throgmorton? I am, but not interested. What? I'm a private investigator, just arrived from Boston. I was told you might be able to help me. Private investigator, you say? Well, you perhaps we can help feel off. If I may ask, what happened to your son? Why do you care? What's your angle, outsider? Well, like I said, I'm a PI. Finding people is kind of my specialty. Oh, is please. It? Well, Albert was part of a deep sea expedition I commissioned. This useless fool over here says he found Albert washed ashore in a lifeboat. Says he was barely conscious, out of his mind, talking gibberish in some other language. That he even tried to bite him. And you don't believe him? Complete malarkey. I know my Albert. I raised him strong and smart. The best of his kind. It couldn't have been him. Albert's disappearance is the work of Innsmouthers. Mark my words. I've heard you're the man to speak to about... visions. Outbreaks of hysteria. I'm trying to get to the bottom of it myself. Another newcomer with another problem. <laughs> yes, I know what you speak of. Can I ask you a few questions? How oh, dare you. My son Albert is missing, and no one in this Innsmouth, a ridden city, will do a damn thing. But yes, let's talk about your dreams. Uh, you were not going- Ah, oh, I screwed up. I should have actually paid attention to the stuff. There's a possibility that I need to pay more attention to which things go before which. Which is interesting and makes a lot of sense. Oh, okay. I'm not going to shit on his face. not the biggest fan of these Innsmouth. Those fish-faced freaks have overrun this city since the police burned Innsmouth to the ground. But now, those filthy migrants occupy half this damned city. The port, Grimhaven Bay, Salvation Harbor, the shells, they are everywhere. So they're just... refugees? <laughs> Hardly. They've taken work from the local fishermen, they stir and agitate against us, the Throgmorton family. We are the pillar of this community, not to mention that crime rates have skyrocketed. Simply speaking, they are a big stinking pile of trouble. I'm not going to shit on his face Mr. right now. Throgmorton, let me help you. I'm rather good at tracking down missing people. I'll find Albert. What makes you think you can do it? Oakmont is not exactly friendly to new arrivals. Let's just say I tend to see things that others miss. That's what a PI is for. Anyway, what have you got to lose? Sounds like you could use every man you can get. Vera. You have a point, newcomer. Okay, so let's see here. I gotta be v most likely very careful with my words. And let's see. I really don't know how I'm going to edit this. This has a lot of stuff that people may want to know, which means I thought I was going to be able to cut uh, some stuff out, but with how much stuff is needed for actually like doing PI work, it may be important for me to keep everything in. Oh God, this may not be the best one, but we're going to see how it goes. Cause I am, I still want to know about this game. Sorry, did you just say Vera? What does that mean? You had better get used to the Oakmont dialect, outsider. That is, if you want to fit in. It is a fascinating blend. Vera means fine. I was saying, we have a deal. I see. Thank you. I'm not going to ask him about his face. Stop trying to trick me. Tane, did you not listen at all? I already told you everything. After leaving on the expedition, Albert was found on the shore in a lifeboat. This fisherman supposedly brought him to the house, and then left to call me. But when I arrived here, my son was nowhere to be seen. Anything else? Clearly, something suspicious occurred inside the house. 
I suggest you stop dawdling and go see for yourself. Okay, fine, I'll ask it. Forgive the question, but I've never met a man quite like you before. That's because no man measures up to the Throgmorton lineage. Proud and powerful blood flows through our veins. My father united with a certain royal family, which has blessed all our offspring with these exquisite features. Very well. At this least he wasn't offended. Weather, Mr. Throgmorton. It's time for me to get started. Find my son, newcomer, and be quick about it. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. First things first, we got to get to the shore. Holy crap. What in God's name are you? What in the actual hell? That's a cat. But it's like, oh my, oh. Ooh. Let's get the shit figured out over here before I head in town. Um. I've said everything I know. Of course he did. Don't do anything stupid, newcomer. And keep your hands where I can see them. Me, 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 me. I gave you clear instructions. Up yours. Oh, I can go in. Well, shoot. Okay. I can go in the back room. Let's get everything up here first. Jesus Christ. This fisherman lives in absolute squalor. Fucking hell. These poor people. Holy crap. This dog mat looks better than the owner's bed. Oh, of course. You get the best stuff for pooches. And then you just go in and steal their shit, I guess? Some P.I. you are. The book is damp and damaged, but clearly well cared for. He gives a damn about reading. Okay. I guess with something like this, you do kind of have to be, uh, have your ways to pass time, because, fuck. Hey, Doc. It take tremendous effort to move this thing, let alone tossing it over like this. Huh. Let's see what you find, newcomer. All right, bitch. Come on. There was a fierce fight here, but someone tried to flee. Left out here? It's lost strength. Hello? Hey, can you hear me? Ah. Oh, my head. What? Who are you? Are you police? I've already told them everything. That's okay. I'm Charles Reed, private eye. I knew his name was Charles. Mr. Throgmorton hired me to find his son. Oh, oh okay. What do you want? Um, okay. I want to know what happened here. Every detail. I don't remember much. Me, Paul, and Lewis. We were here. This is our house. Barry was outside on his business. Then he came back carrying Thog Morton's son. He was unconscious, barely breathing. Barry left again to call Mr. Robert. Then what? We put the guy in Lewis's room. Then he started to make these horrible sounds and... Okay, my head began to burst, and he woke up, and after that, I don't remember a thing, just dreams. Drowned streets, a sleeping giant, a voice that called me, ah. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Hey. Tell me about yourself. Uh, name's Will, Will Hammond. I'm a fisherman. We all are. Live here together. Me, poor fellow Paul. Barry and Innsmouth of Lewis Flynn. We moved here after the flood. I worked on the railroad, but the rail ain't kicking anymore, so I started fishing. It was that or starve. Fair enough. Where are all the other guys? Uh, that's Paul there on the floor. Kay be with him. Barry's outside with Mr. Throgmorton. Lucky rascal missed everything. And I have no idea what Lewis or Throgmorton's son got to. 
starting to suspect the worst. Understandable. Who is this K you keep mentioning? Outside, of show some respect. K is our lord, our light, our love. Sorry, I, I didn't know. Okay, so K is their god. Vera is okay. Do you know how Paul died? I don't know. When I pulled myself together, he was already gone. K, have mercy on his soul. Religious man, I say. I'll leave you to it. Take care of yourself. Please, detective, sir, tell me the truth. Could it be me? Did I kill Paul? Or okay. did I kill him? I don't know yet, Will. And the police will stop anyone coming in or out of here, so I suggest you just try and get some rest. I'm afraid of what I might dream. That's understandable. My head. I still hear those voices. Jesus Christ. This doesn't feel real. That people could be stuck Choo -choo. living like this. <laughs> I can barely recognize the face of the poor fella. Damn. He was beaten to a pulp. What the f What? There's a fierce fight here, but someone tried to flee. Fierce fight, someone tried to flee. Five cards short of a full house. Let's see. I'm surprised they don't have someone's portrait here. Huh. Oh, yeah, like one of the rulers? Mind's eye? Oh my god, I got detective vision! <laughs> Oh, that's amazing. Okay. Seems like prohibition hasn't affected Oakmont too much. Oh, is this based in the 20s? The eyes. Never seen knives like this before. Masterful work. Interesting. Oh, fuck. Which button? There we go. Oh, what the? What? That's not detective. That's psychic. I'm sorry, McFucking what? Take this, ape face. <laughs> Take this, ape. What the fuck? Wait, someone was throwing stuff at him. Someone was pulling a gun on him. Or there were two people. What? A bigger man, a much bigger gentleman. His son threw the fuck. Wait, then what was the one that happened in here? What's happening? Okay, let's see what we have here. Oh. What the fuck is going on? I don't understand how this could be happening. I'm so confused. No, 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 no. What? I think I know what to do. Okay. Um, all right, I think I gotta put them in order. One. Two. Take this. Three. Yeah, run! 
When Albert Throgmorton woke up, he was not himself. He attacked the fishermen, and his hysteria spread to them. When he got wounded, he fled. What the fuck is going on? Wait, did I get all the stuff here? Did I get all the evidence? It looks it. Okay, um, first things first. Let's see what the heck this is about. Mind Palace. Did Yo! This is amazing! Okay, Albert attacked the fishermen. The Throgmorton Ortons and Indians Mousers have a feud, of course. Um, sudden psychotic outbreak. After Albert Throgmorton regained consciousness. Okay. What does that mean when you lock it? Combine clues to make deductions. Albert Throgmorton was dangerous and posed a threat to Lewis Flynn and his fellow fishermen. Well, yeah. But there was a lot more than that, dude. Um, okay, let's see what else I can find. Um, let's see here. Okay, I can track down Albert and the fisherman named Lewis for the scene in after the fight in the house. I can track them using the supernat using my supernatural sense. Okay. Um, let's see here. Albert. So basically, I'm trying to go through the the stuff I have to fi get more evidence out of it. It basically. So it's not that I have to hold everything and like have a journal on me. I'm actually able to connect stuff to be able to figure out exactly what I need. Holy shit, this is amazing. Um, let's see here. Okay. Uh, Albert Throgmorton spread some sort of psychotic influence which made everyone nearby suffer hysteria. Okay. An Innsmouther, as an Innsmouther, Lewis and his people suffered at the hands of the Throgmortons. That could be a reason to hate them. I mean, that's entirely understandable, I feel. And... Okay, come on, there was one more. Wasn't there? No, there wasn't. Okay, let's uh, look and give one last once around and then let's head out. There really shouldn't be much more, I don't believe. I just don't want to miss anything, you know? One last thing! I think. Who are you? So, that's what an ends mouther looks like. Really? That just looks like a dude. Oh, that was the last piece. Perfect. All right, then we can drop down this way. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's see if we can talk to uh, him about this stuff. I gave you clear oh, up yours. I was trying to give you an update. All right, let's see where we got to go next. I can track them using my supernatural sense. Okay, so I should be able to hunt them down using... What the fuck? Are you... Whoa. Did I just miss some? Oh shit, okay. Is that... Oh, that was... Is this shotgun and shells? So the fisherman pursued Albert, even let off a few shots. Okay, new mind palace clue. All right, let's uh pin it around with stuff. Oh, straight up. Okay, Lewis may have wanted Albert dead, Lewis may have wanted to kill Albert outright because of us, of because he was a throg Morton rather than just drive him off. Interesting. Those are still breaking. Let's see. Is this the way he headed? I'm not seeing anything. He did head this way. So fucking.
fucking weird. Wait a minute. He climbed up. Albert was wounded. He managed to climb that high. Robert wasn't exaggerating when he said he raised him strong. This is so fucking weird. He actually... Wait a minute. Both of them ran. What the fuck? This game is so amazing. So far. Oh, okay. <laughs> I love when you're supposed to, like, reach in and check on something, and it's just... <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on. Are we heading downstairs? Or are we heading up? Not giving me a clear answer, but that's okay. I get a feeling we're heading down. It's fresh. Whomever it belongs to could not have got far. I get a pretty good feeling that we're heading down, so I'm going to check out up top. Never mind. Not even in a, in my brain palace or, or mind palace. Is that the true term or is that just mainly the term given to it by like the Sherlock show? What are you? There's something in the pocket. Bloodstain note. Lewis, please give me one more week. I can't. I know I owe you, but I'm underwater like everyone else right now. I don't yet have enough stock to operate the bar smoothly with the fuzz snooping around the port. But don't worry, I've struck a nice deal with the proper people and should have a steady supply channel soon. Just one more week and I'll return everything with double interest. Interesting. Who's Peter? I'm going to have to squirm around the mine palace for a minute whenever I get back but first things first i'm going to go through this stuff right now i think i'm starting to figure out how i'm going to structure the video a bit but we're going to see when i get there uh the first episode may be a little rocky though Thor won't budge. but we'll see how it goes i'm very curious to see what's going to happen here oh what am i missing there's a vent the garbage can. Let's crouch down and get up to this basket. Nada. The door won't budge. What if I just? Yeah, the oh, fuck. Shit. Yeah, that'll do! What the fuck? Wait a minute. Yo! Okay, that's not a noose. That's a meat hook. One fatal round through the forehead. That's no accident. This was deliberate. Oh, shit. That's a whale. All evidence collected. Oh my god, that is disgusting. Holy shit. Okay, all evidence collected. Nothing else here. I'm gonna go... Holy god. Before we give the evidence to Throgmorton, let's just get our mind palace straight. Bar owner is indebted to Lewis, and Lewis left the crime scene. Lewis may be at the bar. The Innsmouther that killed Albert Throgmorton may be hiding. And Albert was murdered, which I need to get more information on. Fuck, is it possible that by making these connections, I'm actually losing other stuff as well? Poor Throgmorton, man. Mr. Throgmorton, I've encountered something, uh, What? I don't have all day. Some unusual creatures, and they sure weren't friendly. 
You've seen a wild beast, Mr. Reed. I'm somewhat surprised to see you still alive. Those unsettling things appeared after the flood. I've commissioned a few studies on them, but we know little more than when we started. They're aggressive, but fortunately, not immune to gunfire. Well, that's good. Yeah, I like that firsthand. Try to avoid them when possible. And when you can't keep your weapons handy. Mr. Right. Morton, I'm afraid I have bad news. Oh, no. Yeah, I found your son in the basement of a nearby warehouse. I'm sorry, but he was murdered. Shot in the head and the body hidden. No. It cannot be true. No, no, no. I don't believe it. No. I'm sorry for your loss. My condolences, Mr. Thwartmorton. I had hoped for a happier outcome. Your condolences will not bring him back. So much of our blood spilt for nothing. So much effort in vain. My poor Albert. Tell me you know who did it. I want to look him in the eyes. Make him beg for mercy. I can't be sure yet. Don't know exactly. I have some suspects, but I need to investigate further. You what kind of private eye are you? A thorough one. When I find him, I'll tell you. Fine. No one leaves the port until then. Find me that dirt bag, and I'll help you with anything you need. I don't know enough to just pin it on Lewis yet. That's like that's not fair to him. Ooh. <laughs> That could have been bad. Oh god, this is going to be a... V okay, I'm going to be ending this episode here. This is going to be a very interesting series to do, to edit. God, the timing on it is amazing. Like, I literally am running a, running a detective D&D &D character right now. And luckily, JT is my DM, is blessing me with a fucking mystery. And I'm so excited to work through it. But this is just, oh my gosh, I'm so happy I didn't look at this, this game beforehand to understand what it was. Oh, this is going to be great. All right, I will talk to you all later. I hope you enjoyed, but I need to get to bed for work tomorrow. So I hope that you all have a good evening. Good night.